Before today, I already loved Netflix. Today, I love Netflix more than I ever have. So let's react to the Dark Crystal Age of Resistance. <laughs> Dark Crystal Age of Resistance right now. It's probably the hardest thing that I've ever worked on. I had to think of it as sort of a work of art. It's something hundreds of people created. It's a wonderful texture and depth to this world. It was the most work, it was <laughs> so the cool. most difficult, but it was the most fun, it was the most rewarding. And of all projects, it's the one that I'm the most proud of. Nice. Good for you, Jim Henson. Okay, let's see the new stuff. Here we go. Oh. <laughs> okay, so from everything I understand about this, and thank you, Cody Leach, for sharing this on my Facebook page, otherwise I would have never known this popped up today. I love the Dark Crystal. I, I grew up on the Dark Crystal and Labyrinth as a child, loved both those movies, and as much as I love the Labyrinth, and I do, Dark Crystal always stuck out to me as just as my favorite. I mean, it's just so delightfully weird and creepy, and, you know, I can see why Jim Henson in that little video there said, like, you know, it's the project he's the most proud of. It's, it's very good. Of course, watching it as a child, I just freaking loved it. Watching it as an adult, yeah, it's a little different. And my wife didn't grow up with it as a child. So I made her watch it to share in my childhood and she fell asleep. So if you haven't seen The Dark Crystal and you didn't grow up with it as a child, I don't know, maybe you'll fall asleep. But if you grew up with it like me, I'm sure that means you absolutely loved it and it could do no wrong in your eyes at all whatsoever. This Netflix series looks so incredible i mean i guess from what i understand this is a prequel series uh the dark crystal age of resistance i mean i don't know too much other than that that it's a prequel series that final shot there of the sketchy with his little eye oh I, I just can't wait oh i don't know i just wonder if it's gonna be like mm, you know like they do in the movie i don't know i'm just you know the truth is I'm kind of going into this blind. I don't know too much what they're going to do in this series. And I feel like I don't ever want to know. Like, I don't want to read up too much on it other than to know it's coming out and to find the release date and then react to, like, a real official trailer. Because otherwise, like, I just want to go into this blind and absolutely surprised. So, anyway, I had to make this video today to share with you my utter excitement for a prequel series to The Dark Crystal. Age of Resistance. Yes! Okay. Anyway, what did you think of this? Are you excited for the Dark Crystal Age of Resistance? Did you grow up with Dark Crystal as a child? Do you have a special place in your heart for the Dark Crystal? Let me know in the comments while you're there. Hit that subscribe button to become a Durbanian. Next to the subscribe button is that bell. Click that bell. That way you're notified the moment I drop new videos. Like, as of the day that I am posting this video, tonight I'm going to go live for the first time ever doing a live spoiler-free review for Alien Covenant. So things like that I'm super excited for. I've never gone live before, so we'll see how that works, but I'm, I'm just excited to do it. Anyway, I'm sorry. I keep thinking about this Dark Crystal thing. I cannot wait for this show to pop up on Netflix. Netflix, I love you. I'm Durbin. Thank you for checking out Durbania.